Hello, Zane. Hello, Nicole. Welcome back. I don't want to get arrested. See you. Well, you shouldn't have shoplifted then. Please. You know what I mean? I don't want to get arrested. I have to go to work today. Please. No. So what happened, Zane? Uh, started washing her because of the merchandise and the amount of merchandise she has in that cart, which is the stuff outside the door. Um, she selected the cat stuff, groceries, stuff in bakery. Um, walked over to the produce wall there by the grocery door, and then turned and went out the grocery door, and I stopped her out on the sidewalk. Perfect. You gonna type everything for me? Yes, sir. Please. please is she getting trespassed forever? Yes. That's please good. Don't Smart. Me, please. I was gonna say that's a good idea. Stay please. seated, Nicole. Please. Don't be standing up. Please don't arrest me, please. Yeah. What do we got here? I'll be the witness. I have a work. I have to go to work today. Please. No. Oh. He promised me there was no cops involved. I said if you did not come with me, I would have to call the cops. Nicole, this is a notification of restriction property. This means you're trespass from all Walmarts in the United States. You could never come back to Walmart. This is a lifetime trespass. If you come back on the property, including the parking lot, it's a misdemeanor. If you steal with this in effect, it's an automatic felony. I need you so to... So what's going to happen? This means you can never come back to any Walmart in the United States. Okay. So it's a witness. Okay. No, he, he's, he's signing as the witness that you have been notified of this. I need you to do print and sign. What's going to happen? This means you can never come back to Walmart. That's what we're talking about is that right there. So again, you cannot come back into the parking lot. You cannot come back into the can building. Can I still go to work today? I have no idea. That is not Please. up to me. This is for Walmart right now. So if you come back to Walmart, you will be arrested for trespassing. Do you understand? Yes. Okay. Cool. I have to read you something. I have to read you something. I don't want to get arrested, please. Okay, we'll have to read this to you. All right, you have the right to remain silent. You understand? No, please, <laughs> please. Okay, you have the right I to remain silent. I have work today. Can I go to work today? Nicole, I need to read you this. I know what this means. That's fine. Then let me read them to you. You have the right to remain silent. Do you understand? Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. Anything you say can be used against you in a court of law. Do you understand? Yes. You have the right this time to talk to a lawyer and have him present with you while you're being questioned. Do you understand? Yes. If you cannot afford to hire a lawyer, one will be appointed to represent you before questioning if you wish. Do you understand? Yes. You can decide at any time to exercise these rights and not answer any questions or make any statements. Do you understand? Yes. And do you understand each of these rights I've explained to you? Yes. Okay. So what? tell me about the stealing. I needed food. I'm starving. I had no food at home. Food stamps are... I don't have any food stamps. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Where do you, uh, I need are clothes. you living up on, still about, uh, 1165? Yes. Okay, did you, did, did Katricia move? No. Okay. So you needed food, because you're starving? Yes, I don't have clothes either. Mm -hmm. I needed a litter box so I can get my mm -hmm. cat's stuff. I wasn't trying to do it on purpose, mm -hmm. I needed it. Yeah, you needed $40 with a ribeye steak. I needed some food, we needed meat. Mm -hmm. So you went with rib ribeye. We needed something to eat. Mm -hmm. Like a sirloin wouldn't be good. Like you just were like, well, I'm, I'm stealing. I so just randomly matter. grabbed something. Like the most expensive one. I didn't know it was that expensive. Because you were gonna steal it. I didn't know it was that expensive. I didn't look at the prices. Yeah. S'more cookies. I was. We were hungry. My we're boyfriend hungry? has to have sweets. He's diabetic. Cool. Okay. Let's see what else we got? Mm -hmm. Twinkie. I mean, a lot of sweets. <laughs> Cat tree. My cats needed it because they keep clawing at the walls. I don't want to get charged with damage to the trailer. Yeah, I mean it's easier to like if you're gonna steal something. If you're gonna if you're gonna damage someone's property, just steal, right? A mug. A mug. Yeah, mug. Six bucks. I didn't take a mug. Hmm. Okay. Here's a pack of root beer. Oh, mug root beer. What's the root beer for? Needed something to drink. Like water's not good enough. You got water shut off at home. No. You don't, do you? Could probably drink water. Yeah, probably could. Have. What else we got? Uh, this is men's Reebok for eighteen bucks. Probably underwear. Underwears. Men's shoes. Your boyfriend ain't got no shoes. He just came in here barefoot. They moved down here from Virginia. Oh, I know it. I know it. I did. We just moved back. No, I know. I heard. I heard yesterday. I heard about it. Where's your boyfriend? At home. At home. 
He just sent you down here to do the stealing. Yeah. Did Trisha move? No. She's still living up there, too? Mm-hmm. You're 18, right? 19. 19. Yeah. Why'd you come back up from Virginia? I need to restart. Well, it wasn't, didn't, wasn't working out so well when you were here. So. I just need to go to work. My job called me, called me in. They want me to come in today. I work at Dairy Queen right down the road. Philly cheesesteak? What's that one about? It was a sandwich. Oh, chicken bacon ranch sandwich there. $140 scoop free? What is that? Is that the litter box? It's an automatic litter box, yes. An automatic litter box? Like a regular one wouldn't have worked? I couldn't find one. You couldn't find a regular one? You just got the most expensive litter box? See, Nicole, there's a big difference between uh, being hungry and needing to eat. We were hungry, but I didn't need a litter box, and that was the only one I found. No, 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 no. There's a big difference between being hungry and then, uh, and then what you did here. I think you know that. You know that? We needed it. We didn't have no money. I don't mm-hmm. get paid till the seventh. We don't have no food stamps. We've already used up our food bank stuff mm-hmm. till the end of the month. The community action center? Yes. And your mom don't give you no food? She didn't she didn't have food when I got up there. Your boyfriend's up here from uh, Virginia. Yes. How long do you guys plan on being here? So we've been here for a couple weeks. Yeah. Already committing felonies. It's not good. So, you got a criminal history. From when you were a juvenile. I don't know. Virginia, you get arrested in Virginia. I really need to go to work. Yeah, no, I understand. I understand. They called me in. They called me when I was here. They yeah. They need to be at work. Did you tell me you couldn't talk to them because you were stealing? No. I left that part was out. That yeah. Left that part I'm out. I'm supposed to be there by 6:45. Mm. Mm. Yeah, by 6:45. <sighs> oh boy. Oh boy. I don't know, Nicole. I don't know what to do. Please. Hmm. Hmm. Let me talk to. Let me talk to Zane. We're gonna figure it out. So just hang out right there for me, all right? Don't go nowhere. I'll catch you. You're dead. What do you want done? What do you want done? You want to you want to forward and get the hell off your property, or do you want me to take her to holding and fingerprint her? It's up to you. I think she needs to go to holding. No, please, Kelly. no, please! Yeah. I really gotta go to work. Please, Works sir. For me. Please, sir. Please, I yeah, want to come back can again you get ever. Me this done tonight? Please. Um, most likely depends on how long she was in the store. Um, for the video, okay. entire video of the store, but I can definitely get you a statement tonight. Please. Okay. So tell me again please, what happened. No, Sit back down. Please, I gotta go to so work. So I started watching her over in. Uh, pets. Um, she was moving stuff around in that cart. She had some high dollar pet stuff in there. She picked up the uh, scoop free pet thing and put it in there. Please, sir. Um, some kitty litter went over to grocery, picked up some cereal, um, went over to bakery, um, or went through meats, got Please. the steaks, went through bakery, got all the sweets and stuff. And then she went into produce and grabbed the sandwich there off the deli bunker thing, mm-hmm. the sandwiches, and then stood right there next to the door. Until she thought nobody was paying attention, and then turned and went right out the door. Which doors? Grocery side. Past all points of sale. Yep. Clear out on the sidewalk. Clear out on the sidewalk. Stand up. Please. There's no please. Stop. Can I call my mom? Stand up. Please, my mom's going to come get me. Stand up. You can call her when we're there, then. You are under arrest for theft, second degree. What? Please, sir, don't do this. Please. uh, Nicole, first of all, let's get this right. I I didn't do nothing. You did it. Can my mom bail me out? Uh... I don't know, you know what, I'm going to figure that out, Nicole, because I want to see, uh, maybe there'd be no bail. Please, no, know. please don't do this, sir. No, no, once again. I won't come back. Well, I know you won't come back. Please. But once again, I'm not doing anything. My mom texted me, can I just see what she said? Nope, you are a big girl now, Nicole. Can I just see what so, she said? I'll just do it up there. Okay. No, nah, we can do it in here, lots of people watching. Nicole, do you have anything on you that would stick me, stab me, poke no, me, anything I like that? I just need to see what my Face mom said. the wall. Said. I need to see what my mom Spread said, feet. sir. Please. That's my phone. And you are being audio visually recorded. Do you understand that? Yeah. Do you understand those rights I explained to you, or do you need me to read those again, Nicole? I understand. Okay. Back of my hand. When can I call my mom? I don't know, six hours or so. No, I need to talk to her so she can come get me. See the back of my hand? All right. You got anything else on you other than your phone? No. 
Nothing else? No. Okay. I gotta call my work. I'll do my best to have that for you. If I, I if gotta call my work, answer. sir. Oh, okay, we're going this way, Nicole. Um, do you want me to call in the case call number? My work. Yeah, just call the front desk. I think Sam's working. He'll give it to you. All right, thank you. Yep. What's gonna happen? Well, um, you stole eight hundred dollars worth of stuff, so I guess you'll sit in my holding facility for all six hours. Fingerprinted and photographed, and we'll go from there. Let me call my mom, please. I need to call, make sure my boyfriend knows where I'm at. Yeah, face the car. Please, sir. Well, this will be a good lesson. Maybe he will learn not to send you to Walmart to steal. I, but I, if I tell you something, he said if I didn't go steal it, he was going to kill me if I came back empty handed. Uh huh, go ahead and have a seat in the back. I'm call. serious. That's my mom. He abuses me. Oh, okay. That's my mom. Okay. My mom was gonna call the cops on him. Mm-hmm. Okay. For threatening to snap her neck. Okay. I'm serious. While you're in the back of my car, you're being on invisible recorded by the in-car camera located directly in front of you. Thank you. Paul with four six zero. If I didn't advise, I have one in custody. Oh, you look so sad. I have a right to make a phone call. Well, I actually read you my rights. I have a right to make a phone call, though. Oh. Uh, what's that? I have a right to make a phone call. Mm, no. To an attorney, if I question you, I'm not going to question you. Easy peasy. Boom and four six zero. Transporting one female. I need to tell my mom where I'm at, please. Beginning when you're ready. Please. She. I just told her she needs to come. Yeah, I just want to make her about traffic stop from County. What's that, Nicole? My mom. I just told my mom I need her to come bail me out. She texted me. No, well, she can call the PD then. She'll know where you're at. When can I get out? Mm, six hours. In six hours? Mm -hmm. And then I'll have a court. Yeah, like I would assume, you committed felony theft. So what would happen? Would I get released? What do you mean would you get released? You're not in a court tonight. Huh? You'll get released in like six hours. I'd get released in six hours. Six yeah. hours, confirming your arrest. Six hours. Yeah, I had it done. I mean, unless there's something else that I don't know about. Yeah, that's the plan. Would I be able to get a ride home? No. I live all the way across the city. Okay, you're an adult now, Nicole. When you were committing crimes as a juvenile, it was a little different, but you clearly have not learned a single thing. In six hours, I can get released. You're not lying. Unless something else pops up, yeah, that's the plan. And then I just have to come back for four. Yeah, you, well, you'll have to find a way to... Yeah, they'll, the prosecutor will send you stuff for court. Could I pretty please call my mom when I get there? No. Please? No. Why? Because, Nicole, when you were here before, all you did was commit crimes. You leave to... Where'd you leave to? Virginia? Yeah. You leave to Virginia, and the second... You can't even make it a month back here without committing a felony, so I'm not doing you any favors. I can't help it. It's a medical condition. I'm a klepto. I can't help it. Okay, all right. Yeah, yeah. I've been diagnosed with klepto. Okay, well. It's a disease. I can't help it. Great. Maybe the maybe the prosecutor or the judge will uh, give you a prison sentence so nobody else has to be victimized. I don't know what to tell you. Will it literally be six hours or less? Or it depends. No, it's gonna it's gonna be the full six. Huh? It'll it'll be the full six. It will? Oh yeah. I can't Nicole, you're a klepto. I can't if I release you any sooner than that, you just that's the sooner that you can steal from people. I understand you can't help it. I don't know how to can I get my phone back? Can I get released? Yeah, you can get it back when you get released. I'm not gonna keep it. You get arrested for anything when you're down in Virginia? Is that a lie? No, it's not. Like you made it all that time without getting arrested? Yeah. So I run your criminal history, that's what it's going to say? 
Okay. What if I make you a deal? I run your criminal history, and if it says that you were arrested in Virginia, uh, I'll know you lied to me, and then you can go to county. You still sticking with that answer? Yes. Okay, good, good. Who's this guy? Paul, oh, 460, all right, depending when you're ready. But it still has to be six hours? Oh, yeah. Why would that? Why does it? 4879, reception, teleport. I already told you. You told me you can't help but steal from people. So if I can keep the city of Pullman safe for six hours, I'm going to do it. It's You're going to be walking, Nicole. There's too many places you could steal from. What if somebody left something outside? I'm not going to steal anything. Well, you can't help it. You told me that. I can't, but I won't. You can't help it? I can't help it, but I won't steal. Oh, no, that's, no I, I can't do it. Virginia. Can't risk it. Can't risk it. So I want to at least let my boyfriend know that I'm gone? Why would you want to let him know? Doesn't he want you dead? Yeah, but I still care about him. He's going to worry about where I'm at. All he knows is I went to the store. And he's going to see that I didn't come back. And then now what's going to happen? I don't know what's going to happen. Well, I mean, like really like nothing's, nothing's going to happen. Like he'll just wait for six hours. Hopefully he'll think I'm still at work. Yeah. Yeah. Because he knows I'm supposed to be called in. Yeah. We're going to take all those groceries to work? No. I was going to have him come get it. Oh. Hmm. So you walked up to Walmart and then you're going to have him pick you up? Swing your feet out, don't hit your head on the door frame. Stand and face that wall. Okay, Nicole, come this way. Unless something else pops up. Okay, brown chair over there. There's a white pillar next to it. Stand and face that for me. Face this white pillar. Perfect. Stay there. Okay, Nicole, when I take this uh, handcuff off, just put your hand on that pillar, okay? okay. Have a seat in that brown chair. Remove your shoes, any piercings, or a belt if you have one. And a belt if you have one, not an oar. Shoes in that bin. No belt? No. No piercings? No. No jewelry? No. No ring? Mm -mm. So your only property is phone and shoes? Yes. Okay. Nicole, talk about your boyfriend threatening to kill you. Well, he threatened to kill me. He said that if I didn't come home with full hands, then he was going to kill me. That was tonight? Huh? That was tonight? Yes. In front of your mom? No. 
but she, he has gotten a snap on neck, and she was going to take him out, but she's giving him a chance to get help. Did he say how he's going to kill you? No. Why didn't you mention that before you were arrested? Because I didn't want him to go to jail. No, you don't care. His, his mom will kill me. What do you mean his mom will kill you? Because she told me to take care of him, and if I'm not taking care of him, she's going to come down here. What's his name? Garrison. G-A-R-I-S-O-N. Middle initial for Garrison? A. Data bird. Or last name. St. Clair. S-T-C-L-A-I-R. What's his date of birth? 01-02-2004. What's going to happen to him? Well, I'll go talk to him, but he might get arrested for a felony harassment. I don't, I don't want nothing to happen. Yeah. Here we are. I don't so, want nothing to happen to I him. can't afford for you to be victimized, Nicole. I'm be fine. I don't want nothing. I have the right to choose if I want to press charges or not. Nope, because you two are in a dating relationship. Yes, I do. Nope. Yes, I do. Nope. Don't you worry, Nicole. I don't want no one talking to him. Okay, well, I got to. I got to investigate it. No, you don't. Sure do. Please, don't. Nope. Nicole, just like I got to make sure this property of the city of Pullman is safe, I have to make sure that you are safe. I am safe. I'll be fine. No. Nope. He's never hit me. Him threatening to kill you. I got to take this serious. Have a seat in there. Please don't do anything to him. I don't want him arrested. Okay. Please. Okay. I have a choice if I want to or not. Nope. You're in a domestic violence relationship. I have to. I have to make sure you're safe, Nicole. You lied about that? Oh. Hello, I'm Officer Patty with the Pullman Police Department. Who are you? Garrison. Garrison? Hey, Garrison. Uh, the reason I'm here is I uh, arrested Nicole for stealing from Walmart. Uh, okay. Did you know she was going up to do that? No. No, you didn't? Okay. Do you have an ID I can take a peek at, Garrison? Uh, I don't. I lost my ID. Okay. So Lindsay didn't tell you she was going to go to Walmart to steal? Uh-uh. You guys don't got any food in the house? A little bit. You're not starving? No. Nothing like that? Spell your last name for me, Garrison. Uh, S-T. Middle initial, or uh, first name, spell for me. G-A-I-R. I-R. S-O-N. S-O-N, middle initial for you, Garrison. A for Alan. Alan? And date of birth for you? Um, 2004. 04. What month? Um, 2004. Yes. What state is your driver's license or ID card through? Um, Roanoke. What state? Roanoke, Virginia. Virginia. And a good phone number for you, Garrison? Um, 540666. I don't know my last few, few digits. You know the last four digits of your phone number? Okay. Paul, I'm 460 name. Last of Robert, first of George Adam Ida, Robert Sam Ocean Nora, middle A Adam, 204, mail through Virginia. So you, you didn't know she was stealing? Uh uh. Neither you nor Nicole is starving. No. no, you got a little bit of food in the house. Yeah. You got diabetes? Maybe. 
Maybe, I don't know. You don't know? You're not diagnosed with diabetes? No. Okay. So you don't need sugary foods to live? Mm, somewhat. I don't know what that means, Garrison, if you've never been diagnosed with diabetes. Yes, actually. You need sugary foods to yeah, live? Yeah, to keep myself normal. Keep yourself normal? Mm -hmm. Okay. <clears throat> sure don't. Garrison, did you tell Nicole that you were going to kill her if she didn't come back with full hands? No. You didn't threaten to kill her if she didn't steal for you? Do you know why she'd say that? No. That don't make no sense to you? No. You don't have an ID? No, I lost it. You have anything, any sort of identification? Um, my identification's on her phone. Your ID's on her phone? Mm hmm Does it concern you at all that she accused you of saying? No. If it's normal to you? Doesn't bother you? Doesn't bother you that she told me that you said that you were going to kill her if she didn't come back with full hands? No. No big deal? I never said that. No, no, I understand that. She told me that. Oh. That doesn't bother you? No. I don't think you understand my question. You're okay with her telling police officers that? I didn't know she was stealing or nothing like that. Okay. Is Katricia home? No. She's at uh, her boyfriend's place. Down in Lewiston? You don't have any idea or anything, nothing like that. No, I lost it. You don't got your phone? No. I broke that long time ago. So you don't got a phone? You just use Nicole's? Yeah. Any other names, Garrison? Mm -mm. Is your name hyphenated? No. You don't got two last names? No. Just the one? Just the one. First name? You ever threatened to snap Katricia's neck? No. Nothing like that? Never. Is that something you would do? No, I couldn't do it. You couldn't do it? No, never. Because it's wrong? It's wrong. Okay, You're well, wrong. it is wrong. Yeah, murder is wrong. So, what's going to happen when Nicole gets released? Mm. Just go back to normal. Go back to normal? She's not in any danger? You're not going to hurt her? Never. Because that goes my heart. How long are you guys planning on sticking around Pullman? Um, about for a while. For a while? You got a job? No. I'm you... looking for one, though. Okay. Is she working at Dairy Queen down there? Yes, sir. You working at the Dairy Queen? Okay, I think that's all I got for you, Garrison. Don't... So, she's safe. Everyone's safe. You're safe? Yes, sir. Katricia's safe? Yes, sir. Nicole's safe? Yes. All right. Why aren't you, why, why'd you come up here from Virginia? Why aren't you still in Virginia? The change from what my brother did to me. All right. Well, he I don't... Me, okay. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. I'm sorry to hear that. It sounds like... It sounds like... Uh, well, I'm slowly healing for now. Okay. All right. Well, I'm sorry that that happened. So if you ever need any... You talk to anybody about that or anything, you you let me know and I'll uh, get you some local resources, okay? Okay. Because I don't want you feeling a certain way if you don't got to, okay? Okay. So if that gets to be too much, you call me and I'll get you in contact with our uh, DV, uh, DV people up here, all right? Gotcha. They can get you some help. Yes, sir. Okay, because I don't want you feeling, feeling any one, one way or the other if it gets to be too much, all right? All right. We're here for you, okay? You got to get this Nicole fixed, though. She can't be up here committing crimes. Yeah. Okay? I got that. All right. Thanks, Garrison. Have a good day. You too. All right. Get your phone. All right. You're just going to push out this door here, and then it's going to take you out into our lobby, okay? You're no longer under arrest. Okay.